Hey, what's up guys? It's David here and welcome back to Assassination and welcome to another Mobile Legend most in-depth guide video featuring Roger, the Wolf Hunter. He was in the pursuit to hunt down a magical creature called the White Tooth who attacked lots of travelers to fulfill their hunger. Now, but after defeating the White Tooth, evil power lurking within the White Tooth contaminated the hunter, Roger. And even the purest of heart will be unable to avoid turning the what werewolf, the wild werewolf, under the full moon. So Roger turned into a werewolf himself. Weird. In order to protect his family and friends, Roger decided to travel far away from his home and become a fictional character in Mobile Legends. Oh, Mobile Legends Playground, so you and I can enjoy. <laughs> it's scary little, little kids, right? But, uh, oh, that's actually a really bad story. Anyways, let's get into his guide. Roger is a marksman that can transform into a beastie or beefy or whatever word you want to use fighter when needed. His playstyle is unconventional compared to other marksmen who need to stay back in a fight. Roger is required to jump onto his enemies when he sees a great opportunity and eat his enemies' asses off. Asses, yeah, asses, the plural. The key to be successful in playing Roger is knowing when to engage and when not to, and finding the fine line between using human form and wolf form. Now, before we get into the advanced mechanics, let's do a quick rundown for his abilities. Roger's passive grants him different stats while Roger is in different forms. When Roger is in human form, his auto attack will slow enemy movement speed by 20% per auto attack. It doesn't stack though. In wall form, basic attack add damage equal to a percentage of enemies missing HP. This means the more HP the enemy lost, the more Roger is gonna hurt. And you will notice that in game that he will be able to shred enemy to pieces once they drop to under 40% HP. In human form, Roger's first ability will rapidly shoot twice, dealing a certain amount of physical damage in total. And the first shot slows enemy and the second shot does the most amount of damage and the second shot, if hit, will also reduce enemy's armor by a huge amount. So in a fight, you want to initiate with this ability to lower enemy's armor as well as put on a tiny bit of slow on them. Then you immediately follow up with one attack and cancel to cancel the cast animation, casting animation of your first ability. Now, let's talk about Roger's first ability in wolf form. When cast, Roger will jump onto a selected enemy and deal damage to the selected target and two other random targets near the selected target. While jumping, Roger is untargetable, meaning immune to everything that's coming toward him. Even though it's a very really short period, but it still works. For example, if you time it right, you can use this to dodge auto attacks or Cyclops ultimate and so on. This ability's cast range is actually fairly high, fairly high. So it is a great tool to gap call. The cool thing is, this ability's cooldown will be refunded for 80% every time you get a kill or assist. This means you will be able to cast it multiple times in a team fight. Due to this is Roger's main damage ability, we will put a point into it at level 1 and max it out first. Roger's second ability. In human form, Roger can activate this ability to give him a huge speed boost for 2 seconds. The duration can extend by a short amount if you land an auto attack on enemy unit. This ability is extremely good for chasing or escaping due to its insane movement speed boost. In wall form, Roger will send out a huge AoE sensory field to detect enemy champions. If there are enemy champions who are below 40% HP in this gigantic sensory area, Roger will gain a huge movement speed boost, instantly makes him the fastest champion in the game. The sensory field will detect enemy in bush if they are below 40% HP also. Even invisible units like Natalia will also be revealed if they are below 40%. But the only problem is you can't target a detected invisible Natalia with your first ability because she's still invisible. You can see her on the map, you just can't target her. And you have to find a way to hit her first and then kill her afterwards. This ability also gives the wolf extreme amount of attack speed. In late game, this will make you solo lord turtle with extreme
extreme ease. I use a lot of extreme, by the way. Because it simply attacks way too fucking fast. It won't be able to react, and the turtle is already dead. Roger's ult, or third ability, can be casted at level 1, and this allows him to transform between two forms. Human to wolf transformation will leap a small distance at a pointed direction. Any units hit at the landing location, a small area, will take a decent amount of damage and get slowed by whopping 90% for 1.5 seconds. That's a lot of slow. <laughs> Wolf form will grant Roger lots of physical and magical armor and increase his default movement speed by 25 points. Wolf to human form transformation will grant Roger a small shield that lasts 1.5 second max. That's why I like to engage with human form first and then leap onto them for the slow and damage before I activate my second ability and bite them to death. So why don't we talk about Roger's playstyle in-game and standard engage combos. Roger is extremely mana dependent and you want to be able to get the blue buff at the beginning of the game comp to compensate for your high mana consumption. Now, if your team has a Hayabusa or a Fanny who requires blue more than you do, well give it to them and kindly buy one magic necklace or two instead to compensate for that loss. You usually want to start off and engage on jungle monsters with range form to lower its armor and then jump forward into a war form to activate your second ability for the attack speed. Don't spam your first ability unless you have sufficient mana or blue buff or you will be completely useless when critical moment arises. In lane, you want to focus on last hitting minions with last hit setting on and when ch enemy champions overextend, hit them with your first ability and then leap onto them to charge to change to your wall form and start auto attacking. While in your wall form, I recommend you auto attack one time before activating your second ability for the attack speed boost. This way, you can actually cancel the auto attack animation and save some time. When enemy champion is about to run away, make sure you use your first ability to either finish up the kill or gap close. If you time it right, you will travel to wherever the enemy target is after the animation. Meaning if they use flicker, you will still be teleported to them. It's super cool. Also, get used to the basics of marksman where you move a bit and then auto attack once and then move a bit again and then auto attack again to take advantage of the auto attack timer. A note here is, even though you are a wolf, but do not, do not tunnel vision onto one target, okay? Be aware of the positioning of your teammate and enemies. Do you have backup or is enemy team taking, you know, kiting back and focus you? Because if they are, you need to give up your pursuit on the target and transfer into human form and quickly activate your second ability again to reposition before engage again. Roger is very squishy in nature, like any other marksman, so getting the balance of engagement right is extremely crucial for his success. Regarding Roger's rotation, we add a test and find out that without enemy champion close by you, that's under 40% HP, human Roger runs faster with second ability. So when you rotate between lanes and jungle, make sure you use human form and activate your second ability for the speed boost when you can. This credit to my friend Mr. Boom and Kensley for helping out, you guys are awesome. With Roger, I always take Purify and Fighter Emblem sets to support his fighter nature. The reason being that when you jump in your war form, if people CC you, due to your squishy nature, people can easily kill you. So getting Purify and Lifesteal is crucial for him. Now, what does Fighter Emblem set offer, you may ask? You can quickly go to Emblem Sets and take a look. Emblem Sets give you physical attack, armor, magic resistance, movement speed, HP, as well as attack speed. That's everything a wolf can ever dream of. <laughs> so it's crucial that you have it. If you don't have this, an another Emblem Set called Jungle Emblem Sets is also pretty good on him. Because of the standard Emblem Sets I take for 80s, for 80 carry, for Marksman. Because this also gives you a lot of attack speed, physical attack, armor, as well as movement speed. And that's what Roger need. All right, let's go into Roger's item build. You should build something different based on enemy team's team comp, obviously. But the following core item sets are what I found 
to be the most effective and most overpowered on Roger. Now, first, I usually get Berserker's Fury. This will give you extremely amount of damage early game. Now that is important because I see people building Scarlet Phantom on Roger first. And what happens is you will always lose to a Berserker Fury Roger because you won't have enough damage for the attack speed to be meaningful. Now after that, we'll pick up Warrior Boots, um, Warrior Boots to give him more armor in war form. Follow up with Scarlet Phantom and Task Claw. These four items are core for Roger and will make him effective in both human and wolf form. Now after that, I usually get Blade of Despair and Immortality for the extra damage, attack speed, and survivability. You can also get Deadly Blade if your team requires it. Just swap out Blade of Despair or delay it until you can sell your boots for Blade of Despair later. So this is our complete guide for Roger. I hope you guys are able to use some of the information and pave it forward and last but not the least, if you like this guy, give us a thumbs up and hit the subscribe to join Team Assassination. And this is Assassin Dave, peace out. Please enjoy the Scores Legend ranked gameplay featuring Roger the Wolf Hunter. Yeah, oh, my, I'm banning, oh, I'm picking. As, why do you have to add as Dave? You just said Dave. You don't have to add the ass in front of it, okay, Mr. Boom? <laughs> I am ADC. I tell let people oh, know I am ADC. Dave. He wants to play Saber. No more marksman. Please. No more marksman. Oh my god, this is freaking sensor stuff, dude. How is this so, so BS? No more. Why is no more? N O M. No more. N O M O. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my Wow. Alright, let's do let's do jungle first. Once again. <laughs> it's actually a much better strategy. Alright, let me blue. Okay, good. Cyclops going bottom. Alright, Layla AFK. It's an AFK pick. Good job. Hey, let me take, let me take, let me take. Make this good egg. This only took me forever. Let's go. Oh, we should have taken the small cam actually. Oh well. What? What's with that? What's with that jump? There was a minute in front of me. I would have clicked. There you go. Let's go. Oh my god. All right here, all right here. I'm up level four though, so we can engage on them, no problem. <laughs> I'm sure Aura is still here, waiting in the bush or something. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wow. 
solo bot on my right. I sold him. Blade? Saber Blade? Wait, Saber all! Saber all! Saber all! Oh! Oh my god, Saber, dude! You have all! If you all, he'll die! Holy moly, dude. Oh. I should be seen, dude. <laughs> I think Lala is not here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Go back. I'm coming. Kayla's dead. What? Are you eating the mic? I don't know where they are. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Go back. Are you eating something, Mr. Boom? Mr. Boom, what are you eating? Oh, I thought you were eating cocaine or something. Like you're you're so young. Don't waste yourself. <laughs> I'm a little scared, I don't know where they are. I'm scared of Natalia. Oh. Oh my god. Why is Layla mid bottom is powers gonna get pushed? <clears throat> Saber and never again, huh? Like one. Saber, oh bottom. Yes. Go focus on. Okay, both either of them. Nice. There you go. Oh boy! Nice Get fucking trashed. Get fucking trashed on. Jao. Like he really think he can I'll play the wolf. Go, 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 go. Yo, 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 yo. Oh. Natalia's bottom, right? Okay. And where's my uh Yeah, just push. I got top tower. Hey, where is blue? Who took blue? I don't know. Shaper? Someone take blue? Maybe Natalia. Oh, Does not have blue? Go, 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 go. Nice. Nice. Good job, dude. There. I have all five three seconds. <clears throat> Top tower. Top tower. I have to go back. Power's gone. Let's 
so buffed. It says I still have blue on my under my feet, but I don't. I'm gonna change my profile to all take minions. You take what? Minions. <laughs> hey, change the minions. Yeah. <laughs> Do yeah, it. yeah. MS Kira says hi, Dave. Go. Oh, we need help. Alright, he's dead. Penta, penta, penta. I can't. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, no. Oh, my God, Sora. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, you guys got him. This guy just killed himself. He just killed himself, didn't he? Go back, go back. <clears throat> this is the only ADC that can solo Yun Zhao, dude. Like, I just solo Yun Zhao top lane. Like that's that's that, that's a little bit too much, I think. You know, obviously when you're not doing you're really not doing anything else, just farm, extend your lead, and then go home now. I'm out of mana. But <clears throat> this is the only ADC that can solo win job. That's too much. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at that. <clears throat> Movement speed 300. It's only 87. 311 now. It's so buffed. It says I have blue buff when I don't. Let me see if they. Wolf is coming. Wolf is coming. Wow, me and versus. <laughs> I can just bite him. This guy just stand there and let me bite him. Okay. Go, 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 go. Wait, wait, wait. I'm taking blue. I'm taking blue. Wait, wait, wait. Natalia's behind you. Did I, even, I didn't even get assist for that? You think I want to jump in? You think I'm... I'm I think they're blue. Yeah, come, come. Alright, now I really have a blue. Yes, yes, we... We can do five men. Uh, we have, I have never done five men for a while, so I like five men. Okay. Oh, uh, we we only actually we have we only have like a few people on our squad right now, <laughs> so we have to need a lot of people on our squad. <laughs> really, Franco? Where do you go? Push ball. Holy, Franco! Jesus Christ. Good job. <coughs> Back the fuck out. Oh, mid, mid, mid. My ass about to get raped. Yeah, I have us all, right? How about Lord? Do you guys want to Lord? <laughs> yeah, we can do Lord. There. Okay, let's go. But Maya's right here. Maya's right here. Where? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think oh, yeah. You're dead. Go Franco, go go go. No, there, I'm coming. Oh, Natalia. Don't 
Так. Here, quadra. No, too late. Too far away from me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Push, 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 push. What did you do so fast? Okay, just push. Hey, look at the attack speed, dude. Damn. So, so, I'm not a mana. Oh, <laughs> feels bad for him, dude. Get pushed out. Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, dude! What the fuck, man? <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh god! Oh my god, oh my god, you're gonna get on Kingsley. <laughs> Bottom hair tower, it's gone. 300 tower. We can easily take turtle. <laughs> Let's take turtle. Look at the boots. Yo, dude, that was scary. You're under the gloopy. Achievement, achievement. It's all about those achievements, dude. Oh my god, that was so awful. <laughs> huh. I'm coming. Yo, you jumped behind us. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Nice, dude. That's game. Where is Jumjao? Oh, he's dead. Go. GG.